Hello, Malcolm. Hello, everyone else. Welcome back to Halcyon 6. Uh, we are continuing with our new crew, Episode 2 of Series 2. Icons will appear over your officer's portrait to show where they're currently deployed. Oh, I, oh. Okay. Well, we'd better start getting some uh, business accomplished. We've got a heavy cruel fleet out here. And we've got how long left on them? We did take out the portal, so... We've got 15 days left on the Mankar colony. We'd better return our fleet to Starbase right now. Uh, they are in transit to Starbase. Let them get there. Oh, don't run time. Oh my god. Time runs so fast in this game. It is madness. So, do we have time to upgrade any of these ships? Well, let's take a look. So, let's just check our ship types here. We've got an Acolyte class, a Knight class, and a Rogue class. So, let's pop off to the upgrade thingy Pontacular here. Uh... Well, the Knights had an upgrade. The Acolytes had an upgrade. So I guess it's the Rogue. Scrapper gives damage and evasion. And this gives aim and hull. Oh. I like damage and evasion better. It says estimated 15 days. We'll just confirm that we were looking at a Rogue here. Yes, indeed we are, so let's go back. It's probably faster keys for all this stuff. Wrong button. Or wrong room, rather. Um, so, aim and hull, add officer. Let's take our level 4 engineer. Six days. Well, we've got a save we can go back to if we totally bone this, so let's confirm her in the task. And let some other people do some stuff as well, I guess, eh? We'll send our unassigned officer, Tim Simmons, out in a shuttle to gather things like fuel. Search one. Put Tim Simmons in the seat. There you go, buddy. We'll launch that. And we'll go back to the station. And we've got some exploring tasks available, so we're going to jump in there. And get Lucas in there, five days, confirm. And, uh... Oberon's not doing anything. What can he do? Work in the Dark Matter Multiplier, maybe? Yes, he probably could do that. Dark Matter Creation 1, Add Officer. Over on Yulmas Tactical, 12 days, no, no can do. No, do not want to. He will go out in a second shuttle fleet to garner something else. Here, he'll go here and get this batch of stuff that's over here. Maybe he'll have time, maybe he won't, we'll see. Send a fleet search to... And put Over on Yulmas in, launch. I don't know, I should look and see where the time estimates for all this are, because I could be making a mistake, right? Ghost head, transfer 28 fuel to fleet, leave system. So, now he could go somewhere else. Uh, really, there's not a lot of good potential places. But Tim's a free agent right now, whereas Oberon's not so much. So let's send Tim out here as well, because we'll probably have to turn Oberon back right away. So I'm going to go ahead and go here, send a fleet, search one station at Ghost Head, redirect fleet. We're going to pray we don't run out of time on this. Just trying this out. Love seeing the two ships fly there. So we grab some dark matter. It's nice. We'll leave the system. And so... 
Oberon stationed here. He's going to go to this materials mine. And good. Grabs 90 materials. Good to get. Leave system. He is going to return to home. And this guy's going to grab 117 materials. Leave system. And I don't know if there's any other colonies we've actually discovered other than the one that's about to get melted. So what's our timer on that? 11 days. So yeah, this is taking some time. Uh, so search 2 is headed back. Search 1 can keep on boogieing. Maybe they'll find another colony. Planetary Star Regulus, send a fleet. Search 1, redirect fleet. We'll do that. Commander, we did it. The oscillation on the dark matter multiplier was a complete success and we created 300 dark matter. Oh, that's really actually really good, eh? So, hopefully we're going to work out here. Tim Simmons' fleet made contact with a colony. Continue. 36 crew. Boarded. Leave system. We're not going to evacuate them right this second. We're going to see if we can get a materials mine uh, here. Hope we've got everything properly figured out. Cleared out the sector, acknowledged we're not going to task any other tasks right now. Tim Simmons reports that the materials mine is in ruins. That's a shame. We'll send a fleet here. And Dark Matter Extractor at Vila is in ruins. So then we'll go to this next planetary system. We're just going to keep on searching, basically. And we got resources in. And I bet we're really almost out of time, eh? Nine days. Okay, we're alright, we're alright. So, what's the task situation looking like here? One day left on the Enforcer upgrade, and that's going to be what we have to go with. Freaky stuff. So we're going to um, allow that upgrade to take place. Colony below us has been destroyed. We should. One moment. We're picking up signal from the surface, patching it through. They're everywhere. Og, here they come. We've lost the signal. We are going to have to try to rescue them. Oh, it's a biggie, too. I don't like it. And we, all we've got is cadets with us, eh? Oh, and it's getting the first blast in. Thank goodness it missed. So that exploits blinded, that inflicts shocks, that inflicts shock, that heals. Uh, we want the one that exploits if we can get it, so... We did inflict shock, this exploits blinded, this inflicts exposed, so we'll just inflict even though we probably can't exploit. Ah, we missed and he didn't. This exploits afflicted, he is shocked. This inflicts shock, so we'll just fire our regular laser pistol pow and so we're not gonna have any exploits I don't think unfortunately so we will do mine toss here luckily hit him but we're not doing that well too bad we can't blind him he's really hard to kill this does more damage if it hits we can mine toss again, it is our best attack. Oh, he's healed himself to a huge and disgusting degree. The pig, and we just can't hit him either. Maybe the higher power has a higher chance of hitting. Definitely just gonna toss mines at him here. That's the engineer's way. Okay, we are badly mazered. Um, that's not good, I don't wanna lose a crew member. But he's okay. We're gonna nano med here. That should help. Oh no, that's not good. We'll do the drone attack somehow here. He is now exposed and not in great shape, so maybe we will. No, we won't. Mine toss, not gonna do the job. Not at all. Oh no, he excreted bomb again. Uh, I think that guy said we were going to die. That's not very cheerful. At all. 
least we hit it a couple of times. Oh, no, 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 no. Just dreadful here. So, we try the mine toss every time. Hopefully we'll hit with it. Oh, no, that's just... This is not happening. Oh, no. We're having a bad time here, man. Thing is just dancing aside all our blows here. Okay, we got him in critical, so luckily we got nanomeds back the same turn. He's gonna do drone attack. And miss she's gonna try the hand taser. And miss. This thing is the devil to actually hit, man. So this does the highest damage, but it doesn't seem to ever hit him. Oh good. We might get him now. Yeah, we got him. Wow, that was a toughie. Let's hope we saved some people here. Victory, small reward. Ah, okay. 95 survivors. That's pretty nice. Um, we are going to redirect this fleet out here. Search one. That's just how we're going to play it. And back at Starbase. Sorry, I always hit the wrong button. Days remaining one still, so back to the star map. And we'll just let that fleet fly. Okay, Hangar Tier 1 has completed its task, so now we are going to get after those Krull. After a quick save game here, I think. Just a little quick save. Not only, only keeping one save slot, so I could totally mess it up. Uh, our colony is under attack. We probably have no days left. We got eight. Okay, we're we're good on that. So we're gonna send a fleet, and it will be Hapland. Fortinbra needs Oberon in the seat, and then we're ready to go. We're as upgraded as we're gonna get, and luckily we have the fuel. I hadn't really thought about that. So we are on the way to Doom here. Materials mine in ruins. Well, he's gonna go here. He's gonna get some space flight time in. Dark matter extractor. Continue the heroically offer. I think we're going to pull them out. Um, I think we will pull them out. So they get six dark matter a day, they get max of 213. I think we're going to chance it and pull them out. This would, well, 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 well. I'm not really sure. But they're pretty distant, so we will. We'll pull them. We're going to go ahead and do that. So we did evacuate one, and now we'll send the search team to the next applicable star. Hopefully we won't use up the fleet that's needed for the trip to meet the cruel. We made contact with the fuel refinery at Ex Persei. Uh, continue, transfer 29 to the fuel, and I think... Oh, they generate 3 fuel today, but their max capacity is 29. It takes forever to upgrade them. We're going to pull their crew out too. Good thing it's a big shuttle. And it's going to proceed onward to this. They've been lucky not to get jumped by pirates. Empty and offline, but dark matter is still aboard. Uh, we're not going to risk the team for dark matter. Basically. There are very few people at that colony, but it's in fuel range. And we can go re-harvest all this junk. So, search one to the colony. This is very hopeful, assuming we're all going to survive this conflict with the damn Krull. Grab the 10 crew, leave system. Because, yeah, this may just all be an absolute reload. So he's got the most reserves. Let's see if Search 1 can actually reach him. Yes, it can. And we're in combat. Here we go, folks. I'm going to use my usual tactic of focusing on the weakest. I'm going to upload the virus first. Got two of them sensors offline. Got oh, a critical hit on one, which is good. Uh, backstab will probably recharge. We've got exploit sensors offline, and this gives us a bonus. It doesn't do a lot of damage to him, but uh, it 
gives us a bonus. That's bad. That's all quite bad. He has no conditions on. What can we inflict? Hull breach. We can inflict ship disable with the shock mines. It exploits crew panic, which we can get later. We're gonna go ahead and salvage harpoon him, because that's a nasty hit. Now the uh, thingy bus is going to bend space time on itself. The Prospero. Let's hope that we can get through this. We don't have much healing or anything. So he's got hull breach. Can we exploit it? Uh, doesn't look that way. We could backstab him, but I almost want to save that up. So we're looking for best damage. Let's exploit sensors offline. I wish it had worked on him, eh? That's the best damage. This does inflict engines down, so we're going to go ahead and do it in case that helps him not hit us somehow. We've been real lucky on that. We're going to warp atomic structure on him. This is pretty scary combat right now. Exploded hull breach. So now... This exploits engines down, which he's got, so we're going to hit him with that. He's going to give us a nasty poke, and we're going to return with the pulse cannon, taking him right down to one-shot status. We're getting pretty blasted, too, though. We'll just take this guy out here. And we're going to do a heal round on this guy. Uh, not enough. Oh, man, this is pretty bad. So next target is the next weakest ship. I think we are going to go for sensors offline. It worked, amazingly. So... Uh, none of these exploit sensors offline, unfortunately. This inflicts a hull breach, so we're going to go ahead and do it. It's deconstructing nanobots. It doesn't do a lot of damage. Harass exploits sensors offline, so we are going to exploit it. Nice damage. That was very ugly. Now we're really totally messed. Uh, I don't think we're even survivable at this point. We don't have a healing system for anything. Uh, I'm gonna ram. Didn't do that much. We're gonna backstab. Disabled him. We're going to try healing again when our last heal. Thank goodness it was pretty good, and thank goodness we dodged that. I'm going to bend space time on the... Which one has the better weapons? I don't know. But we're going to get that sped up anyway, so we can get some more shots in here. Now, that guy's down at 295. He's got sense... No, he's got empowered systems. He's got hull breached. Can we exploit hull breach? Uh, no, we can't, but we can try to... He's already disabled. Uh, I think he's already disabled, so back to our powers. We're just gonna have to flat brush him. Nice shot, anyway. Oh, he did a healing round. And we got banged. Uh, what's he got? Resistance to ship disable is what he's got, the little jerk. Uh, crippling shot for engines down. Let's attempt it. And let's just peg at him. And then exploit engines down and hopefully finish him right off. Good thing, because he didn't do that much damage. And this guy has another shot, so... We can try to disable ship. Uh, resisted the effect. We'll attempt to inflict engines down. That worked. We'll attempt to inflict crew panic. Uh, that worked. We got mazered pretty hard. Okay, so... He's got crew panic and engines down. So this exploits engines down. We're going for it. Didn't get that much. Uh, it's upload virus or portal cannon. Well, we've got things that can exploit sensors offline. He resisted it, damn it. So that doesn't help us. So he's got crew panicked, so... We can't do anything to exploit that? No, we can't. I haven't got this figured out right. we got engines down on him. We're a portal cannon now. Good shot. 
Oh, nasty return fire. Okay, so if we'd gotten sensors out fine, we could explode it. So we're just gonna fire. Did okay. Uh, we got anything disabling? We've got hull breach potential. He's got engines down we can exploit. Did okay with that. Portal cannon just to get that bunch of extra damage. And then we're gonna backstab because it's back up on. And we might disable him, so it'd be good. He resisted the effect, but we're gonna polish him off. So we did save that colony, thank gracious. So we're gonna get all officers back to the uh, place, I think. So they've got zero crew right now. We're gonna leave them up and running. Uh, oh my god, a cruel portal. What kind of shape are we in? We're pretty badly damaged. It's two ships, but we're too badly damaged to uh, deal with it right now, so we are going to return home. Something strange in the fuel plant. We don't want to really know what it is, but it seems to be some sort of excrement. In other words, feces. We have no idea where it came from, unless one of our engineers really had to go to the washroom, but it doesn't seem to be human. Full investigation for 25 materials or clean it up and forget about it. Full investigation. Hmm. They'll send some to the lab. Dandy. Not too pleased about the whole uh, jerk faces showing up in the region, and we left that uh, nice delicious dark matter there. Maybe we'll redirect fleet. Four four fuel there. We'll just, now Hapland is what? Transit, so we'll let them both fly. Okay, we're gonna take these 84 materials and leave the facility. That must be down south here. Yeah, so what's next? The dark matter or the materials? It doesn't matter. Neither of them are really very full, but we'll go ahead with it. Fuel 5 for that run? That seems like frippin' madness. Pull out that dark matter. Let's get out of here. And these guys need to return to base right now. Okay, we've got 90 materials to grab, we're grabbing Get the system. It's good to have this shuttle fleet out and running, i got to tell you. There is an unexplored star. I'm getting the feeling we need everyone at home. We will send Search 1 there. Refinery in ruins, fuel still on board. It's not worth it for fuel, even though there's experience points to be gained. So if search one can reach this, we'll send them. Yes, they can. It's eight fuel. That's pretty deadly. Lab results are back on the stuff found there. It's not feces, but a type of algae that is forming around the plant. Something even more interesting about the brown algae. It may have grown from the fuel refinery plant itself. We may be able to harvest fuel from the algae. It's extremely volatile, so there is some risk. Harvest algae. We'll start the process right away, let you know when we're done. It may blow up. We had good luck on the last thing we tried, so we might get bad luck on this one. Tim Simmons has been attacked by pirates. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. Why isn't there a retreat button? Why is there no retreat button? He's gonna try to repair himself. Hopefully. Oh, we're going on there. Yeah, why don't we have a retreat button here? Uh, this is no good. We're about to lose hundreds of people. Yeah, we just lost hundreds of people. Bye. Why can't I retreat? What is the problem? Are we not warp capable here? We're dead. Uh, why is there no retreat button? I suppose this was always a hazard. I suppose this was always a hazard. I don't think we're going to make it. No, 
we're not going to make it. It's just not going to happen here. This is so bad, man. We can't do anything. He's he's done. Oh my gosh, this is just wrong, man. Uh, how is this happening to us? This is so awful. Tim's a very brave officer, gotta tell you that much. Oh my god, we're just so messed. Oh no, we're blown. Oh no, dude, no. Oh, we just lost so much stuff. We even evacuated a facility with him. Oh, I just feel sick. Day 56, when was our last auto save? Oh no, I guess we just have to deal with it. Oh no, this is dreadful. Oh, I just feel sick. That was a huge loss. And we lost a freaking officer, man. Oh no. Those pirates, man, we're gonna we're gonna go. We don't have the fuel. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, this didn't go well. No, it didn't. Repair all. This did not go well. Back into the fray. Where's the hose? Now we don't have any officers. Oh, why did I hit start time? Uh, algae harvesting team reports. Good news, they harvested it and it yielded 46 fuel. And we can continue to harvest it, but it's just as risky as before. Halt harvesting, acknowledge. Seems like a waste, but you're probably right, they say. I'm good with one batch of luck. I'm so mad at those pirates right now. Oh, this is not nice. Upload virus immediately. Hit them both with it. That's kind of sweet. Um, then we're going to choose our foe and backstab him right away. So, try that out. I think good to use it in the first round, you know? Okay, so can we exploit sensors offline? Nope. And he's already disabled. Um, we could hull breach him. We could salvage harpoon him. It's pretty nasty. Let's do it. Hull breached and vulnerable. So he's just covered in conditions. And space time on the Prospero itself. I don't know why. It's because it has the healing, I guess. But it only has three healing, so it's not really worth it. Um, I don't know if we have anything that exploits crew panic. Exploits crew panic. Okay, so it's worth doing. Warp atomic structure. May you sink into your command chair, you freak. Okay, that took the hull breach off, though, so... Now, he's got... Uh, crew panicked, vulnerable, and sensors offline, so... We'll exploit it with shock mine, which might disable him again. He resisted the disable. That guy enraged himself, which isn't good, because it makes him far more dangerous. All we can do is power off a little portal cannon shot here. And we've got... Vulnerable and sensors offline, so we can exploit vulnerable with teleport explosive. We can knock engines up, down onto him, or we can exploit sensors offline with harass. Didn't do that much. Um, we will try to crew panic him again, because I think the big ship exploiting it is going to do more than the little ship firing portal cannon. And it did work. Okay, we're taking some fire here. Um, this exploits engine down, inflicts hull breach. He's got vulnerable on. Uh, we don't have anything that does that. I think we're going to go deconstruct and try to hull breach him again. It did work. Hull breach is a bad thing for them. So we can either sensor offline or exploit the hull breach with the portal cannon. I think we'll try to go sensors offline. It only worked on the one, but that's good because we're only attacking the one. 
Exploit sensors offline. Perfect. Did some nice damage. Took a nice t hit in return. I think we might just be able to polish him off with the portal cannon right there. So now... This guy has enraged, which isn't great. We're going to deconstruct him to get a hull breach on him. That should... Oh my god, in one hit? Are you kidding me? Can we disable him in any way? No, he has hull breach. We can't exploit hull breach. We can inflict engines down. We did. Uh, we'll be just healing immediately. Holy smokes, man. That was just amazing. So this inflicts hull breach and vulnerable. What's he got? Engines down, hull breach. So... Exploits engines down, flak barrage. Did okay damage. Um, we can re-inflict engines down. What else has he got? Just hull breach. Um, so we will re-inflict engines down. It's not a bad shot on its own. Thank gracious we dodged that. We're going to hit another healing button on that. Wow, that's nasty. That guy does super damage. Backstab, attempt to disable him. That would be nice if that worked. No, he resisted the effect, of course. Uh, what's he got? He's engines down and hull breached. This explodes engines down. Flak barrage it is. Didn't do that much damage. Um, we can try to get a crew panic on him. We can heal ourselves again. We'll save that last healing, I think. Or we can portal cannon him. Or we can bend space time on a big ship. So let's bend space time on a big ship. We'll try the fort and bra this time. Maybe that'll give us more help than anything else. Wow, that really did some damage. So we will attempt to inflict the engines down. It's a good damaging weapon. Then we can exploit engines down. That worked well. We will uh, attempt to inflict crew panic because I don't think we quite need to heal. Although, and we've only got one heal, so we'll wait till someone's really... The, he didn't get panicked, so we'll try to engine down him again. That works. Thank gracious we dodged it. I think we'll just take a poke at him with the portal cannon. Just put him into one-shot territory here. Wow, that's pretty harsh. I almost feel better for losing Tim and like 400 people to, over that, but not quite. What a disaster that was, eh? Officer promoted over on Yomaz, but yeah, we had quite a disaster. Didn't we? Well, we'll pick up some stuff on the way home. Uh, there's not much dark matter there. I think we can leave it. Uh, so we will send the fleet to this colony. We only have the one fleet. Oh, they're going there. Oh my god. Raider fleet bombarding the station. Show location. Oh man, it's going to take us like three days to get there too. Send fleet. Oh, we're like miles out. Uh, that's awful. There's nothing we can do. And who's this? It's the collective server thread coming in to chat with us at the same time. Hey buddy, looks like you've got your hands full right now, and I know you humans are really mediocre at multitasking, so I'll come back later. Ciao. Okay, they've got that in the game, in case that happens, because stuff is random. Okay... Okay, you little jerks, and we're pretty badly damaged, too, actually. Uh, gee, I'll upload virus on the little jerks. Knocked all their sensors offline, I like it. And we will engines down the small ship here. And we will exploit the engines down on the small ship, man. Should do for him. But yeah, we'll just watch, see if anyone gets into critical, so... Just portal cannon the little guy there. Give him a hit. Then have we got anything that can actually take him out? I don't think so, but we'll just fire what we got. Yeah, we took him out. Yeah, we took him out. Okay, we'll warp atomic structure on the big fella. It, who's leading this ship? Hard to hover. It doesn't want to hover. Uh, that was a bad hit. Um, we will... He's got sensors offline. Can we exploit it? No, we 
we can't, so we're gonna salvage harpoon him. It hull breached him. And then we're gonna try to disable him with backstab. It did disable him. That's rather nice. I think we'll start spending some heals. And so he's got ship disabled and hull breached and sensors down. The only thing we can exploit is engines down. We might get hull breached if we do this, so... Oh, I guess it's flak brush. It's too bad we don't have anything better. Ooh, it didn't do deedly either. I'll bend space time on uh, this ship. We'll see how we do then. So this exploits sensors offline, so use that. Didn't do that much. Um, he is resistant to ship disable. Uh, wow, what do we have, right? Just fire. Fire on him. Uh, we will inflict engines down because then the other ship can exploit it. We will run another heal, this time on the Prospero. He finally got a shot off and he missed. Ha. Uh, so what's he got? I have to keep checking. Engines down and powered systems hull breached, so... Can't exploit any of that, so we'll just hit him with the highest damage fire we can peg up. That did the job, so we'll run a final healing blast here before we finish him. And then we'll, yeah, finish him. And we got to use up what healing we had, so that probably saved us a buck or two on repairs, so that's kind of nice. That's good. We secured something from the pirate wreckage at some kind of map. Bring your fleet back to Starbase. And we can decode it. Lucas Beaumont gained fast and furious. Ship combat speed plus three. Valentina Chow gained structural engineer. I know how to make the ship stronger. Co space combat health plus five percent. And a map. They were en route to the Pulsar. Records of some kind of treasure hoard of stolen dark matter. Likely guarded. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll pick it up. But right now, we don't even have shuttle officers. Uh, Oberon Yilmaz got a promo. So he could go up to Backstab 2, Into the Fray 2, or he could get Suicide Run 1. Uh, or he could upgrade some of his ground combat. Slice and Dice 2. That might be worth having, eh? Oh, that's all an enemies. Ah, interesting. Backstab's fantastic, though. Oh, this just raises the damage on it. So, actually, there's, there is definitely some space for thought here. Oh, he is reckless, isn't he? That was his nature. That does very good uh, damage, but I don't know what Reckless 2 will do to him. This is all very tricky. Suicide run. Inflicts ship disable and exploits vulnerable. It inflicts ship disable. Even though it's a suicide run. It is his trademark thing, so we're going with it. That's sweet. Okay, so we're we're in a bit of rough shape here. Um, we need to go to tech research. And see about getting the Terran Starship Tier 2. We still need another 800 materials before we can do that. Can we pick up a Trilithium Reactor? Yes. Can we get a Zerordiax Reactor? No. Ship Repair by Propulsion Lab. Sound interesting. Satellite Drone Control. I don't know how to use yet. Well, okay, we got some materials to spend and vague idea how to spend them. There's the collective server thread gone. So, and we're we're alive here. Okay, that colony is at max reserves, so. And we should send fleets out to get some of this stuff. We lost an officer. Oh, so first thing to do is to... Oh, no, and it'll cost more and more every time to get an extra officer. Officers unavailable. Right, they're not at Starbase. 
We need to return that fleet home just quickly. In transit starbase, just run them there and good. Hunt down pirate fleets, objective complete. Slight reward, which is nice. Decoded the pirate map. Now we've got all the fleets on our map, which is nice. And yeah, so we've got to get another officer uh, right away. So every time we lose one, we're getting a problem. So that sucks. 12 days. Lucas, you're in charge, buddy. And what does the Cadet Academy do again? Tech Research Tree. Cadet Barracks. Research. Recruit crew and upgrade cadets. We can research it. Let's do it. Let's do a little interesting gameplay here and build that. Let's try to get staff. So let's build that right next to the Officer Academy. Uh. What's the problem here? 503. There it is. Recruit additional crew and chain NTF to be more battle ready in ground combat. I don't think this was even worth the research. Oh, actually, we're really short on crew. We're really short on crew. Because we lost everyone in that stupid mission. What a disaster. So we actually have to send fleets uh, pretty much right away. So we do have two shuttlecraft. Let's get to it and get out to those colony locations. We can pick up some other stuff while we're out there, but let's get this done. Send a fleet. Search one. Select a ship. Oh, we lost a shuttle. Damn it. Search two. Uh, we don't need to select a ship for search two. We just need to crew the PP2 with uh, anyone but Lucas. So we'll put Valentina in charge. Oh god, what if she gets accosted by freaking pirates? Do we even dare do shuttlecraft runs? You know, forget it. Let's put her back in crew of her own ship, in charge of her own ship. And let's create a new fleet and simply send the Santa Satan. Um, Santas. We'll just send the Santa Satan alone to do those missions. Launch without repair. I think she's fine for pirates, eh? So we're going to have to cross the wilds of space. Critically low on crew. Yeah, I know. I just went out to get some, guys. I just went out to get some. So pretty dreadful. 35 crew fleet. Got them. I can't believe it. We lost so many people. Irreplaceable people. Planetary star. Send a fleet. What? No! Ah, oh, damn it. I keep doing that, man. I keep doing that. Cadet Barracks is now online. Show location. So recruit crew one, add officer. Over on, you're on it. Confirm tasks. Oh, I should have read the description. Oh, well, we can read it next time. I will. I'll remember. Hopefully we got enough fuel to do these runs out here. Colony at Delta, Virginia. Continue. 38 crew to fleet. Great. Leave system. Um, we were going to grab that dark matter. I guess we ought to. That's a portal system, so it's useless. It's kind of backtracking to get that dark matter. We're not going to waste the fuel. We've got to get to the next possible colony. So actually, we're just going to go straight here. Send a fleet. Santa's. Fly, Santa. Oh, no, what? Ah, the cruel will open a portal before I get done. We collided with space junk, had to repair 70 materials down. That's not so freaking great. Recruited five crew. Continue recruiting. Oh, really? Oh, nice. I'm quite pleased. 36 crew to fleet. Leave system. I guess they got bombarded pretty hard. Is what happens. 
Redirect fleet. Gotta remember to hit that button. Situation at the Officer Academy. One of their students managed to get their hands on one of the top secret Federation officer teachers manual and are horrified at the actual survival statistics of most first year officers. It's led to a crisis in morale. We can fund an immediate rewrite or call the whiners. We call the whiners. So we lose 15 fuel for some reason. I guess they fly away to the non-existent remains of the Earth Federation, eh? Seriously, like... Accident has occurred in the cadet barracks. Oberon Yilmaz was working on upgrades to the cadet barracks when a beam of energy crashed through the wall, leaving a massive hole and wrecking a good deal of equipment. It looks as though someone didn't properly grab insulate the firing range particle barrier. However, it's likely that wouldn't have occurred if the cadets hadn't been so enthusiastic about their training, so there's that. Oberon Yilmaz either encourages their recklessness or instructs them to stop fooling around. Well, he's reckless. I'm just gonna... You know, they learned their lesson, so... Oberon Yilmaz did their best to rile up the normally docile cadets into enjoying wanton destruction, though most remain mortified. Oberon Yilmaz gains the reckless trait. I had to guess we should take a look at what that does. Traits. Reckless. Doesn't seem to give you any information on it, it's just there. So they all have quite a few traits. Okay, so what's this machine doing in transit to Chrysarium? 117 materials, grab it up. Because we just got runched. It was wrong, man. It was wrong. We lost everything. So disastrous. Situation at the cadet barracks. The green shirts at the cadet barracks have been exhibiting a surprising degree of laziness lately, as well as a generally, general laxity and discipline. This could have serious ramifications for the starbase at some point down the road. Weed out the lazy ones or improve academy infrastructure. Improve academy infrastructure. Outfitting the cadet barracks with a greatly improved array of motivational assets such as posters, looping holovids, and a self-served flavored ice drink dispensary results in a return to median attentiveness. We lose 40 materials. Alright, I'm satisfied with the solution. It'll do. We only have one machine out to gather stuff. What a disaster. 154 dark matter grabbed. Leaf system. And we'll grab these materials up. Love that these turned up so close together. It's actually a little helpful for us. 208 materials. Nice. Leaf system. That's pretty sweet. How many could colonists there built up? Only two. And we've got 21 colonists out there. 16 colonists out there. They might almost be full by the time we get back out there. So, to be honest, well, let's pick up this dark matter. Santa's fleet is doing yeoman's work. Oh, you know what? I should have other people working. Continue recruiting. Oh, that's why his work thing stopped. So they are all working. 200 Dark Matter to Fleet, loving it. And now we're going to head um, to this fuel refinery. Oh no. Officer Academy has completed their task, show location. We can get a new officer. That's what we were working towards here. So. Why is it Valentina Chow again? That's really strange. Cordelia Shaw of Science. Science ships can heal themselves better. Organ failure one. Bridge shot, dimensional flashback. All kinds of stuff, eh? Hmm. I like this one's background. She's got bent space time, a blade of field on single ally, and spin maneuver. I don't like that. I'm going to reroll. Uh, who have we got here? Repair drone overdrive, that's good. And they've got ground healing as well. Supercharged polarity and ramming speed, I don't know much about. 
I don't know. Ooh. She... what? That's very strange. Suicide run into the fray, far at will. Siphon dark matter, which sounds good. Solar flare and stasis lock, which disables. So the engineering one here, who has... Okay, powers. They've got gray goo. That's pretty cool. K. Fra may be the Federation Engineer Corps' most decorated, most highly informed engineering officer on the topic of human and precursor structures. Unparalleled in her knowledge of Federation starship hulls, she's also famous for having slowly eaten ground up decommissioned starship bit by bit over the course of 20 years. So I think we've got our girl. K. Fra of Engineering, you are hired. And we don't have enough crew to even analyze the officer pool. What a disaster. Crew disaster. So we were in transit to a fuel refinery, were we? No, we're stationed at Helix still. Kind of thought we might have uh, not gotten there. I often get it all wrong. So cruel portals popping open. Oh, shoot. She's been attacked by pirates. Independent ends of space pirates. Oh, if only it had only been one against the other guy, all those people would have survived, because he would have beaten one, you know? Uh, what are we going to hit them with? going to frickin' ram them. We resisted the hull breach on ourselves. Do we have any healing? Because this is annoying damage. What was... What happened there? That was completely wrong. Why did it get three attacks to our one? Maybe it slows us down to use that ramming attack, eh? Now we look like crud. Our ship just looks totally... crampodled. Nothing to be done about it, though. Grab that 29 fuel, we're gonna need that. Leave system. Uh, hold on now. We do have a free officer, so we're gonna get them in a shuttle get them heading out. So let's get them heading to this fuel refinery. And we'll get out search two. Search one is gone. We'll get our new officer. Throw her in there. Launch. Oh, don't let her get attacked by pirates. Five crew, continue recruiting. So, and Lucas needs to be doing something here. Well, Lucas, do something. Explore. I could have thrown him in a shuttle, actually. Oh well, he'll explore for now. We need the space. Oops, this guy's got to get launched here. What are they doing since stations? They've got to go here. And then they've probably got to get home pretty quick. Grab that 38 fuel. Leave system. And maybe that shuttle... Now, given the pirate situation, maybe that shuttle will return home. Yeah, I think that's not the worst plan in the world. We've got enough fuel for the moment. We'll just pick up some stuff. Grab that 35 crew. We don't want to get mounched out here. Looks like there's a little dark matter here. Kind of worth grabbing. So we'll grab that up. Oh, and there's some more crew, so we'll grab them up. And then we've got to get everyone home because the cruel will be back at any time, so we'll return home after this. Continue recruiting. 38 crew to fleet. Okay. Leave system. And nothing's got an exclamation point, so we're going to return home quick. Yeah, there they are. There they are. I knew they were coming. So we've got to get our ship home. Yeah, and they're sending someone out to attack a colony just like that. Acknowledged. And we've got pirates incoming as well. Collective Consciousness is here. Hi guys, nice to see some of you are still alive. What with that alien invasion you're experiencing? Ah, uh, thanks. I'm just checking in, really. I've been picking up some of your distress signals. Disturbing stuff. You seem to be in a good mood. It's a new demeanor I'm trying out. Do you like it? I suppose. I'm pretty sure you'll grow to enjoy this affectation over the time. Testing has been off the charts. Uh, you couldn't do something a little more ominous? No, tried that. Led to a lot of unnecessary conflict. Sure, you read about it all at the Academy. And, yeah, he likes this best. And he was checking in and just saying, Hi, Zadoodles. 
got uh, acknowledged. We will now stop recruiting. I'm glad that's done. Corzan Pirate has disappeared into deep space. They're displeased that we broke our word. Forgot about that mission completely. Slipped my mind, dude. Who's this? Oh, it's the Collective. Okay, we gotta get the fleet together and get her out there. We got no choice. So we've got to send Hapland here. We're so short on materials. We really are. Everyone's in their seat. Uh, so we will launch that. Repair all. It wasn't too expensive. We will save game. We will do this combat. Uh, we've got a fourth officer that could be going out in a shuttle, but what with these pirates? Well, look at these rich materials, though. Oh, darn it. Maybe when we get some tier two ships built, but that's quite a ways off, so... Basically, we've got to deal with some stuff. We've got to take our fleet and mop up some trouble, so we'll, we'll just get that done. So let's go. Here we come, you jerks. Yeah, and they're off to attack an empty evacuated place, so that's actually kind of a bonus. So we're going to try to upload the virus, get their sensors. It worked on both. That's really nice. And did a critical hit of 42 points on a thing that doesn't even feel it. So we'll inflict engines down on this adult clipper. And then we'll exploit engines down with flak barrage. Boy, it's going to take a lot more than that, and we're already in trouble, so... Spend space time on the Prospero. Oh, I should have done it on one of the other ones, really. That was dumb. Oh, the damage, man. The damage is just awful. I think we've got something that exploits crew panic somewhere, so we're going to try to get it. About the best we can do right now. Crew did panic, so what exploits crew panic? Oh, well, we should probably just disable the damn thing. Might save us some trouble. Take a little less fire that way. And we'll just portal cannon it with this turn. That's all we got. Now he's got panicked and disabled, so exploits, inflicts, exploits, inflicts, inflicts. Exploits crew panic, but it inflicts. It has too little damage. Ramming speed has high damage, but it seemed to slow us down last time we used it, so we're just gonna flak barrage him. It won't do much. And we'll portal cannon him, it won't do much. But it brings him down into range. Oh, that guy gave us all up. Big Kurt Donkey. So, 237, that's the ship in the worst shape. And we'll try to ship disable this guy. Crew panic exploited. And disabled him from firing again. And we'll just blast him out of the sky. With a single blasting shot of doom. And we'll get this healing going. That's a pretty nasty hit we took. Oh, critical condition, disabled and destroyed. What? Are you kidding me? That was pretty bad, and we've only got one heal left, so... We might be going under, folks. Well, if it's a reload, I'll end the episode, because uh, I'm getting uh, to where I have to do some stuff. So he's got hull breach. Can we exploit that? Not really. Uh, inflict ship disable. I like it. That was crazy. We did disable him. I'm very happy about that. We'll speed... Uh, I don't know, whichever has the most chance of doing harm, I'm not sure which. So hopefully that thing can't fire for a round or two. And these exploit engines down, inflict hull breach. I don't know, you know. Let's inflict the hull breach. Oh, it's already on him. Damn it. Oh, that was stupid. Uh, what's he got? Ship disabled and hull breached. Can we exploit those? No, we actually cannot, but we can engines down him, which gives us something to exploit with the other ship. This exploits engines down. Oh, so does ramming speed. And it does more damage, so we're going to try it out. Yeah, it did okay damage, basically. 
Uh, we do have something that exploits crew panic, so I guess that's the thing to inflict. This thing's still got a ton of hit points, man. Just a ton. It's just brutal. Uh, we can't inflict any disabling stuff. He's got resistance to ship disable. Wonderful. Let's try to engine down him. It did work. Oh, we got mazered into pieces again. Uh, portal or upload virus? Upload virus. Try to reduce his chance of destroying our ship, which he's going to do next time. Can we disable him? Yeah, he's got resistance to it, though. Sensors offline, engines down, empowered systems. So, exploits engines down. Let's crew panic. Uh, we'll exploit the engines down. We're not going to survive this. I don't think we can do this. We're backstabbing immediately. Now that we've got it back, we'll try it. He resisted it. That's just awful. Uh, we'll try to get the crew panic because I think we have something that exploits it. So Plus it might help him not function too well. Did panic his crew. Uh, he just destroyed our ship. So That's a reload. That's a reload. That's a reload. We're out of here. I'm not really... Like, I don't think we'll survive the campaign if we allow that to happen. I'm glad the game doesn't have permadeath, basically. And we'll just load game. Splabby. The key to combat is exploiting status effects with complementary attacks. I do get that. So we beat that. No, we didn't. We didn't beat that? Are you kidding we didn't beat that? Are you serious that we didn't beat that? We actually failed to beat that? I think I must be fl fighting really badly. I'm going to give it one more shot, and if I totally fail, then we're done here. And we're done here. No, I can't believe I didn't beat that. That doesn't make sense, man. That doesn't make sense. We're going to bend space-time on the ship that can cause the engines down that gets exploded by the bigger ship. Maybe that'll be the right combo. And then we will attempt to disable the Elder Smasher. No, we'll just disable the Adult Clipper. Same strategy as last time, but try to just run it a little tighter. Um, so he's got ship disabled. Uh, what do we do? We can inflict a hull breach, and this does a ton of damage. So try that. We'll bend space to... Whoop. No, that's the crew panic one. Maybe we'll upload the virus right now. Worked on the big ship, which actually might be good, because that thing is going to... Ah! Do something along those lines, basically. The horrible monstrosity will inflict engines down. And we've got... Vulnerable to exploit. Suicide run. He's already disabled. Uh, gosh. We want to exploit the vulnerable, so sabotage. We teleport explosive support his ship, which will then apparently blow up in different ways. Portal cannon. Now he's got sabotage, empowered systems, engines down and vulnerable, so we can exploit the engines down with ramming speed or flak barrage. I think we'll exploit it with flak barrage. Because ramming speed might mess us up. That gave us a hull breach. We'll hit him with the portal cannon. And then we'll hit him with the blaster blaster. And that takes care of him. So now this guy has hull breach and sensors offline. So we don't have anything that exploits that right now, but this does inflict ship disable, so we're going to try it. He resisted the effect. Uh, now let's see if we have anything that exploits crew panic. Shock mine, yeah, which we just wrecked. So we won't do the crew panic yet, we'll just fire the portal cannon on him because... Why not? Oh, it exploded the hull breach too, so that's great. 
Um, now he's got sensors offline. This exploits sensors offline, so that might help us uh, in some way or another. He doesn't have any conditions on him, and we don't have any. We'll just deconstruct. It's not much damage, though. But the hull breach does damage over time. We are going to fire a healing on the Santa Satan here because this guy just applies like massive power. Okay, we've got backstab back, so we're going to try it. See if we can disable him. We did disable him, that's great. We're going to bend space time on. I don't know, the Santa Satan. It's it's really hard for me to decide. The, the, the permutations of the game aren't all that complex, but for me they're a little complex. So he's got ship disabled. Can we exploit it? Uh, no, we can only exploit engines down. So I'm not liking it. We're just stuck with flak barrage. I think I sped up the wrong ship, essentially. Yeah, I did speed up the wrong ship. It's okay, he does some damage anyway, and we'll just... Uh, we'll try to get the sensors offline. It worked. It's kind of cool. Uh, so can we exploit sensors offline here? No, we need engines down. Uh, so it's just flak barrage again. We totally sped the wrong ship up. It's doing okay damage. Oh, that's nasty. Uh, what have we got? Um, he's got sensors offline and hull breach, so... That exploits sensors offline, we'll just use it. That's good stuff. And then we better fire that healing quick, because otherwise we're gonna die. And Shockman could disable, but he's resisting disable to 75% right now, so... Uh... It's just so tough to choose, eh? Yeah, if we had the crew panic on him, it might work. We'll just fire the flak barrage again. He's still got 500 hit points. He's just dreadful, eh? I think... Uh, I don't know which ship to use the healing on right now. So we will get the crew panic going if we can. So I'm not sure which ship to use the healing on. Both dogs are here wagging their tails. Guys, don't bug me. Like, seriously, don't bug me. So he's got resistance and crew panic, so... Can, we'll inflict engines down if we can. He resisted it, and he just knocked two of us into critical. That's a bit of a frippin' problem. I don't think we're gonna make it. I think we're gonna fail again, but uh, we got crew panic, so we're gonna try to inflict ship disable, even though he's... No, he resisted it successfully. So we'll just fire heal on one ship in the hopes of surviving somehow by sheer... Raw luck. No, guys! Sorry, guys, I don't mean to shout into the microphone. But these guys are being... Get off of there. I'm gonna get really angry at these dogs in about a second. Wow, we actually got him. Oh my god, folks, we got him. Okay, both of you stop it now. No! No! That's enough. Destroyed the portal. We're not ready to fight the other ships we have to go repair. We're going to run like scaredy cattles back home. And we're going to get this officer working on something right now. Okay, Fry. She's going to get into the cadet barracks and go on recruit one, I think. So that'll be her thing that she's going to do. And we're going to return the fleet to the starbase. And I'm going to beat my dogs with a shoe. No, I'm not. I'm not. But uh, sometimes you feel like it. You know, dogs can be jerks. Okay, we're back home safe at the Starbase. And uh, I think we had a pretty successful episode, even though I did lose that combat. Whoops. We won it the second time. But, man, it was a close run thing, eh? Like, that, that tells me I'm not playing to the best of my... Capability. I could have had a better mix of ships or whatever. So we're going to have to try to do our ship research better for the Tier 2s. We don't have enough materials at all to do them yet. We're going to go wipe out a bunch of pirates next episode is what we're going to do. So hopefully you guys had a good time. I did just save that right. We'll just uh, save it twice. Call this twice. It's too dark to see my keyboard. Oh, i got to fill my fire up too. My wood stove's probably empty. 
twice. Save complete. Return to game. I hope you guys had a good time. We will see you all next time. And until then, bye for now.